I've built many crazy things in Minecraft. Houses, farms, redstone contraptions, but none of them can compare to what I'm going to be building today. Hello friends, it's Aspen, and welcome to our first ever building challenge. Today we are going to try and build the Disney castle in Minecraft, and hopefully it doesn't go wrong. And most importantly, this is my first time ever attempting to build something using photo references. So let's keep our fingers crossed that it does not end up having me to explode it with a bunch of TNT. Anyways, without further ado, let's get building. Okay, first thing we're going to need to do is pick out an assortment of blocks that are going to represent our color palette. So far, I think we're going to go off with the cooler tones, such as like the stripped birch and the stone, and also the blue and the light blue concrete. Just an assortment of blocks that kind of represent these colors, because I don't want to brighten up the castle too much, because it's going to feel more warmer and like non-Disney. And since Disney has the much kind of like cooler tones going with the whole thing, we're going to just go with that. Anyways, now we just have to worry about planning out the build. Before we start building out the shape, um, I really think that we need to sort of raise the ground a little bit so that we can do a little bit of a terraforming. Um, so I think I'm going to raise this up uh, with some dirt by like two. And then I'm just going to come across like maybe by 35 or something like that. Perfect. Yes, that is definitely much, much better. Now I'm just going to quickly build it up and fill it in. Uh, this part's going to take me a while, so I'm probably just going to do a quick time lapse of it. Planning out the shape of the build, I think we're going to start on the outer part of the castle, you know, especially with the castle gatehouse and also the back towers. Um, I'm not exactly sure what I want to do with this, so I think I'm just going to try and come up with something. 30 minutes later, after planning out this build, we have come up with something like this for the outer part of the castle. So yeah, we pretty much have the back towers, which we kind of just kept pretty much straightforward, and then we have the front castle gate. Um, I now just have to plan what's going to go on the inside of the middle because looking at the reference photos I can't really tell how like all the towers and the buildings are placed so this is going to be a tricky tricky part of the video.
Okay, time to see the final result. And, oh my god. Oh, that is so epic. Oh, I cannot believe I actually created this. Oh my goodness. Oh, literally four and a half hours of work and this is literally what we got. I, I gotta say, it does look a lot like the freaking Disney castle, so I think we did a pretty good job on getting that whole thing out of the way. Also, um, I use this pink, not pink terracotta, white terracotta because it adds a nice little pink, you know, output to it. And also I added this little uh, clock to the tower because for some reason Cinderella's castle has a clock on this part. Um, but for the most part it actually looks really amazing. I did really well with designing the towers and everything, so I think... Yeah, I mean, let's do a full roundabout real quick. Uh, you can see that we did a lot. Um, I couldn't find a picture of like this back corner area, so it's pretty bland for now. Uh, but we did try our best in getting everything in constant detail, including these little extensions right here on the back, and the windows, and that weird, very tall tower. Now there's only one thing that we need to worry about, and that's terraforming this part. Um, I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do, but I'm gonna try and figure out how to do this. Honestly, this is insane. Like, <laughs> I just got done terraforming a little bit and adding some greenery, and we're officially done with the build. I mean, I, I can't believe this is actually happening. I, I, this is an amazing build. I'd say this is like one of my top five builds that I've ever done in my entire life as a Minecrafter. But what do you guys think? Let me know down in the comments section. And if you want to see any more building challenges like this one, please be sure to subscribe to the channel, and I shall see you guys next time.